basically it was all about the mindset, kind of imagining what, the, what kind of mindset uh, the character of Arisu was in. And of course with season one, uh, he has overcome the death of many of his uh, precious um, you know, teammates and friends. Uh, so uh, having been through all of that, he's really reflecting upon his own weaknesses as a human being. Uh, so in season two, you have a character that is really uh, realizing how precious um, his mates are, his, his friends are, uh, and uh, he has this uh, determination uh, to solve the mysteries that still uh, abound in this world of borderland. Uh, he realizes how precious um, his teammates are as well, such as Usagi, Kurina, Hata, Jishia. Uh, and so uh, he is even more resolute to kind of survive this ordeal and really figure out why they were made to do this in the first place. Uh, and he, he is also ha has this uh, really deep need to want to go back to the world the way it was. So I had all of that in mind while I was preparing for the character. All that uh, I had against Kuma and also with Mina, um, they were uh, psychologically also very taxing and straining for Arisu and um, so that was uh, very tough but then because I'm playing we are playing a game and uh, game is something you know for example when you casually play these games like you play cards or you play Uno or you play tag but uh, you know, when you think about a game, you kind of think about the lightheartedness or just to have fun. But the games that we are playing in this world, you know, it's about survival. You know, you you could die from it, so it's like a matter of life and death too. It's about surviving. So the gap uh, is uh, something that we do. And of course, this was from season one, but um, I felt that, and you know, I had to. Uh, really feel that and make it real. So I always thought about if I were to join uh, such a game or in such a situation, like how am I supposed to react? So talking about um, the discussions I had with uh, Ms. Tsuchiya uh, Tao, of course um, there are quite uh, a few differences be from the original uh, manga series and um, the, the drama series that we're delivering uh, to you here. Uh, in terms of, for example, uh, first and foremost, there's a different uh, in pacing uh, where they're quite, where Usagi and Arisu are not quite on the same page or where they have certain misunderstandings. And those, pin those points uh, through the, the character arc of these two, it goes at a different pacing. So we had to, I had to talk, uh, discuss with, um, uh, Tao-san, uh, so that we were, we could strike a balance between the differences that that were that, that existed between the two works, uh, and so that we are all, so and so that we were also on the same page, and we agreed um, as to how to approach the scenes. Um, there are um, other, for example, in, in terms of what Arisu was going through, he at a very early stage uh, expresses, or we know that he desperately wants to go back to his original world and he wants to take or go back with Usagi. Mm -hmm. um, but Usagi's not quite sure. We discover that um, uh, she had to go through a lot of hardships in the world where she came from. Mm -hmm. And so um, she's uh, you know, thinking at moments that um, maybe actually Borderman might be better than the original world in, in some respects. So there's a little bit of a... Um, a dichotomy between them, and where they're exactly not on the not exactly on the same page. So we had a lot of discussions about that as well. Um, there are play, there are also differences in uh, Arisu's character arc, where in the original uh, manga series we see him about to give up at certain points, but this doesn't happen um, in uh, the uh, the drama series. So I had to be very aware of that as well. Um, I was also, and we also talked with. Um, um, I also talked with uh, Tao San on this, but like I also had to be very aware of what kind of uh, kind of mental journey he had to go through. Therefore, uh, until he goes, you, you know, he does the showdown battle with Kuma, or for example, what kind of dichotomy or relationship unfolds during the games when he's playing or battling with um, Usagi as well. So, these are the kinds of discussions that we had on set. <laughs>